Gray zone. This is an area for the wearer to scrub up and put on the main clean room attire. White zone. This is a clean area where the wearer changes into their clean room footwear. The wearer is required to remove facial cosmetics and jewelry. Bouffant cap and overshoes are to be worn prior to entering the gray zone. Decontaminate tabletop and bench with sterile wipes and alcohol. Use new surface of wipe for each wiping. Bare hands need to be scrubbed prior to donning the first sterile gloves. Wipe down the packaging using the sterile wipes and alcohol prior to retrieving the sterile content. Carefully retrieve the content from the packaging. When donning, need to avoid bare hands touching the external surface of the gloves. Grip firmly at the folded cuff and slide the other hand into the glove. Pull the folded cuff towards the wrist. Slip the fingers of the gloved hand into the folded pocket of the folded cuff. Slide the other hand into the glove and unfold the cuff over the sleeve. Using the gloved hand, unfold the cuff until it overlaps the sleeve. Disinfect the gloves prior to retrieving the sterile contents from the packaging. Retrieve the coverall from the package. Only touch the inner surface of the garment. Grab the coverall at the waist area. Carefully insert one leg into the coverall. Repeat with the other leg. Bring the coverall up towards the shoulder, then insert the arms into the sleeves. Pull the hood over the head to make sure it covers over the hairline. Cross your legs and zip up the coverall fully. Remove the backing liner and stick the flap over the zipper. Insert thumbs into thumb loops. Pull the overboot over the foot. If crossover bench is used, transfer each leg to the white zone as the overboot is donned. Repeat for the other foot. Fasten the tie strap for secure fit to the leg. Tie the straps of the face mask around the hood. Adjust for a good seal. Pull the goggles headband over the hood. Adjust the goggle to ensure no exposed skin. Tighten the headband for a secure fit. Grip firmly at the folded cuff and slide the other gloved hand into the outer glove. Pull the folded cuff towards the wrist. Slip the fingers of the sterile hand into the pocket formed by the folded cuff. Slide the other gloved hand into the sterile gloves and unfold the cuff over the sleeve. Use the sterile hand to unfold the cuff of the first sterile glove until it overlaps the sleeve. Ensure all the garments and accessories are correctly fastened and secured prior to entering the clean room. There should be no skin, hair, or inner garments exposed. Prior to entering into clean and aseptic area, the wearer must go through the air shower chamber. When the air shower begins blowing, the wearer shall rotate and lift their hands upwards to expose as much surface to the airflow.